Hey guys, it's Galactic from Galactic's Tutorials. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get a custom thumbnail on your video without actually getting partnered. Now, I tested this out on my original account, Galactic's Tutorials, but I wasn't sure if it was just like a random glitch or if I actually caused it myself. But yeah, I tested it again on Animation Central 2 and it worked. And now, whenever I want, I could just put on a custom thumbnail like this. And bingo. So then when I save it, it'll take a couple seconds. Yeah, so now when I save it and then go back onto my video manager, bingo! That's the thumbnail. So how I did this was I didn't have any views, that's important. You can't have that many views, like you can't get a thousand views per day or you will actually get a partnership. But um, if you don't want a partnership, uh, you could also do it the same way and if you have over a thousand views, but you have to uh, decline all the uh, emails that full screen gives you. Anyway, so to, to actually get the thumbnail, go on fullscreen.net, um, link is in the description. Click uh, Learn More under Creators, scroll down, click Apply Now. Now it will ask to connect to YouTube. Uh, full Screen is a very uh, trustworthy company, so yeah, yeah you're, you can grant access to it. Uh, put your email. That is my email. Honestly, I don't know why they ask you for your email if they already have a uh, connection to your YouTube account, but uh, whatever. So, you're actually going to have to wait like one full business day or a week. And let me just load up my Gmail. Okay, so look. Uh, yeah, you will get this if you fail. Uh, I believe, yeah, you'll get an exception, if you get an exception one, uh, the, this step will still work, but, yeah, uh, after one full week, uh, you will get, uh, de denied email, saying that, uh, your subscriber account wasn't that high, you don't have that many viewers, blah, 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 and when you go on to video manager, you will be able to create your own custom thumbnail. And if you don't want the custom thumbnail when you already put it on there, you can just go over here and save changes and bingo, you can do it again. So yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. I was wondering how to get a custom thumbnail for a pretty long time. Uh, I hope this helped you guys and um, yeah, I hope this gets you more views too. Bye.